Hi everybody, I'm Lynn Dowdy from Century 21 Adams in Babylon Village. And today we're speaking to a very favorite person of mine. His name is John Clancy from Expo Advantage. Hello, John. Hi, how you doing this morning? I'm good, I'm good. Well, I wanted to interview you and I wanted to feature all of the wonderful things that you do. Uh, you are uh, a master craftsman at so many things. What would you like to talk about today? Today I'd like to talk about my artwork. All right, let's do it. You see a little bit behind us, just a little sample, and you will see some in the blog, so take a look. All right, so tell me a little bit about what you do. Well, I studied with a Japanese artist, believe it or not, for 10 years. I studied portraits, and then I went into doing a, an art technique called sumie, which is painting on rice paper. So the large painting behind us here, that's painted on rice paper, and the way that's done is you put three colors on the brush, you get one chance to do it, one stroke, you cannot go over it again, and then voila, you have your painting. It's like one of the hardest art forms to master. I also do watercolors, and behind Lynn you can see a picture of a, of a pooch I did. You know, this is a watercolor. I've been doing a lot of pet portraits, I do people portraits. Yeah, I've seen some of the pet portraits you've done, and um, they're wonderful gifts. Uh, there's just so many things that you do. Uh, so tell me how you got started in painting. Um, I took advertising art because I'm actually into advertising also. I do trade show displays, um, a lot of signage, building signage, interior designing. So everything I do is art related. And uh, advertising for instance for brochures, I'm doing something for uh, the people next door over here, their menu, I'll be designing their menu for them, uh -huh. for the restaurant. Um, we also do laser engraving, and I've been doing uh, a lot of things like that. Uh, I'm featuring all these things on a website called thelalatree.com. That would be you. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to put that in the blog so everybody can pick up on it, and if they want to reach out to John, they certainly can, and uh, learn more about what you do. Mm -hmm. um, so what is, your, what is your motivation to do what you do? I just like... Uh, I like pets. I have a pet. I've had, you know, several dogs, and uh -huh. I've done their portraits. Uh -huh. And I think they're the greatest thing on the planet. You know, you can have the worst day of your life, and you go home, and your pet is always there to to greet you <laughs> and happy. That's the truth. That's the truth. Um, what are your goals for the next year? My goals is to yep. really promote the portraits that I'm doing um, and the laser engraving. I'm doing right now. I'm taking patents from uh, the 1800s and laser engraving those into wood panels. We're going to interview him again because he's amazing at what he, he's also a musician by the way. Oh. <laughs> they call me the Renaissance man. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love it. So what is what is a memory um, you know, maybe an odd memory uh, of something uh, or something funny that occurred uh, in your business? Can you think of anything? off the top of your head? Well, one time uh, I did a uh, paintings of the Black Horse in uh, Beth Page. I got commissioned to do that okay. when Tiger Woods was playing there and I was in interviewed on uh, a radio station. All right. And I came out with a couple of funny lines with uh, where they asked me why I painted a particu particular hole or whatever. <laughs> I don't remember exactly what I said, but it was... I can imagine. They, they might have bleeped me out. <laughs> 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 um, you're so good-natured, and um, if you had to uh, give some young person uh, some advice for the future, okay? Somebody might be, you know, a teenager, and they're thinking about the future, they're thinking about their path. Is there anything that you'd like to share with them? I would say just keep at it. If you're going to be, if it's related to drawing and painting, you just have to focus and keep at it. Uh, learn the basics. The basics are the most important thing. They're the building blocks, like learning uh, how to draw a cube or a sphere mm -hmm. and how to shadow it. And in the uh, sumie, there's uh, seven particular brush strokes you have to learn, which are found in the Asian uh, handwriting. Okay. So you need to learn those. And each one is a particular brush stroke, and then you combine these together to create your paintings. Oh, so there's a lot of uh, history involved in uh, the actual art of doing the painting. And you also have to have a lot of patience, I'm sure. Oh, it's very meditative. Oh, okay. All right. Very good. 
All right, so, um, you know, I thank you, John, for your time. And uh, I do want to ask you one other question, though. Let's uh, bring it back to Babylon, Babylon Village. Uh, do you have any special places that you like to visit or go or restaurants? Anything that um, is special to you? Um, I like the restaurants there and I like some of the stores as well. Okay. I mean, they have a lot of unique stores in that in that town, especially at Christmas time when they do the outdoor yeah. events. That, oh, yeah. That's always great to go to. Everybody having you know a joyous time in the street. Um, the restaurants are like uh, a little more eclectic, like Brixton's. Okay, yes. I don't yes. know if you've been there. That's that's uh, good. Then you have the uh, Mexic Tex place next door to that, and uh, Argyle's, of course. Oh yeah. Monsoon. Yeah. They're all good. He likes a lot of them. I like a lot of the restaurants. <laughs> don't there. get me started, right? <laughs> Well, John, thank you so much for your time. Again, my name is Lynn Dowdy from Century 21 Adams, and I appreciate your time, John. Please, if you'd like any more information in regarding John and what he can offer you, uh, you can find all of his information on our blog and profile page. And uh, thank you again. Thank you. Learn more at parkbench.com slash Babylon Village.